Right, Kevin, it's on the uh, minds of many families that have already started to come in here for the event. Everything gets started around 730. People start going into the Cotton Bowl where they can watch fireworks at 940 p.m. Some of these families telling me that, you know, this wasn't on their minds when they were coming to this event today, but now it is telling me, you know, can we just have a national holiday, some time to ourselves without having to worry about a mass shooting? We did ask DPD if they're changing anything when it comes down to security here based off of what happened in Chicago. The answer simply is no, they already have a comprehensive security plan. They are sticking to that and not changing or, 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 or altering any part of that. But at the same time, there's a ton of officers out here, and we know that their eyes are going to be a lot sharper this evening in terms of security because this shooting does put security and safety at the forefront. There's even officers in plain clothes out here, too. So even if you don't see someone in uniform, just know DPD, the sheriff's office and other law enforcement agencies are here keeping an eye on this event, which should bring a lot of people because it's the first time we've had a Fair Park Fourth since COVID came to our shores. Stick with us. We'll have more tonight at 10 p.m. Back to you.